Hi everyone, uh, it's Paul here and I wanted to say a few words about a TV series that's just been presented on the BBC by um, Simon Sharma, who's a, an academic historian who often uses images and paintings especially as the source material for his interpretation of the past. He's made a series, it's available on BBC iPlayer, called The Romantics and Us and uh, it was a very interesting series, terrific really. Uh, I side much more with the romantics than I would have done even 10 or 15 years ago. And uh, I've often appealed to the romantic tradition in order to position design as a kind of bridge between the world of reason which governs the system that we're in and our experience of life which is entirely through how we feel about the relations between ourselves between ourselves and the world and so on and so forth and Sharma's TV programs were really interesting because they they proposed the fact that the conflicts the intellectual and philosophical conflicts of the enlightenment end of the 18th century have persisted and we're still working them out so in some ways we are still living in the long 18th century that's my view anyway and I've proposed that on a number of occasions it was very gratifying to see somebody like Simon Sharma uh, espouse a similar view I was a little less certain about his positioning of the various romantic sensibilities that emerged at the end of the 18th and the beginning of the 19th century and onwards as a kind of pathology uh, as if um, they were part of some kind of illness that had been provoked by changing our material circumstances and our relations with the world and with each other. Uh, my feeling is that the romantic sensibilities as they emerged in relation to the past in relation to landscape, in relation to art and culture and so on, are actually manifestations of a therapeutic culture. And my own feeling is that Romanticism provides us with the most convincing route map out of the internal contradictions of the world or the system of reason that we happen to be uh, living in. So I thoroughly recommend uh, this television series, The Romantics and Us, presented by Simon Sharma. And um, if you're interested in Simon Sharma, this is one of his books. I guess this is the book that launched him to a much wider public. And it's a book that presents our shifting relationship with the idea of landscape and what it means to us because um, obviously we experience landscape as we walk through it and so on, but we, we remember it and um, our relation to it is an emotional relationship. It's a very interesting thing. Um, my interest in the seaside as a form of therapeutic culture explores some of these themes and um, I'm often um, I'm often catching myself speaking to students about the, 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 the rediscovery of those, fee, those, those slightly anxiety-making uh, feelings that are associated with uh, what we understand as the sublime. So um, I recommend Simon Sharma's BBC uh, documentary, The Romantics and Us. Thank you.